uh, we were talking about another fellow teacher that was at a different school, and there was about several versions of why he, he, he left. He was under the impression that I had started the rumor. Or I was, and I was spreading it and kept spreading it. It could be easily affect someone's reputation as, as like, well, this is not good. And, and also since it doesn't really go away. David Castro. I'm a, I've been a teacher for about 11 years now and teach music and piano and band and so I was teaching this I was my early in my career was my first or second year teaching going through with a couple of friends of mine teachers lounge and everything else uh, we were talking about another fellow teacher that was at a different school that had resigned from his position um, halfway through the school year he was teaching in the fall then he taught and, and then he wasn't teaching in the spring when he came back from spring break or from Christmas break sorry and there was a lot of rumors flying around of why he resigned. It was it was all of a sudden, and and so I told this one person because they had asked about. It, said, well, what happened? And I I had said, you know, I, I heard that it was something un, uh, unprofessional conduct. Unbeknownst to me, that my friend was also a friend with the teacher we were talking about, and so she went and did the smart thing, and she went and asked from the horse's mouth and asked him, hey, what happened? And he had he had asked, well, why? And she said, this is what I'm hearing. I'm hearing that. This was, um, you know, it was a very unprofessional conduct that you had, that happened, and the guy kind of got upset, and he asked who who said who said who told you this, and she said it was me, and she was trying to explain to him that it was what had, the rumor had gotten to me, that, you know, this is what was said, and he said no, this is one this isn't what happened, yada yada, and he got upset. There, and there was about several versions of why he, he, he left. I saw her a couple of days later, she said, you know, this was kind of a false thing, so I had, I had stopped, you know, okay. I didn't think anything of it. A couple of years later, I run into the guy, and he kind of co confronts me, again, kind of upset and, you know, rightly so. He was under the impression that I had started the rumor, or I was, and I was spreading it and kept spreading it. He just felt that way, he's felt he's had a, a hard time getting jobs and he has felt that that rumor was still going around and I go, I hadn't thought about it in years. Even though, yeah, I didn't start the rumor or I, but I kept it going, so I felt kind of bad. And I thought about, I should have just said, you know, I heard it wasn't something really good that I should have just said that and said and not tell the rumor. It can be easily affect someone's reputation as, as like, well, this is not good. And, and also since it doesn't really go away. To me, ethics is doing what you think, what you know to be right, even when, even when you know you can do, you can do the opposite, and just doing what, even though you might have negative consequences because of doing it right, but it's still the correct choice to do, to do decisions.